bent over on their own shoes. This is the, the moment where. Well, there he goes. That's the opening try. And that, according to my sheet, is Danny Gilbert. He's in. And uh, that makes it 4 0 to the. Looks at Crossland on his left. To his right, he's got Murphy. Crossland, the man who's received, received the ball, taken on by Metcalf. Metcalf fends off one. Find a bit of room as Metcalf turns the ball inside. There they go. Nice try from Tom Kent. And that's the response from Stanningley. So, a uh, little step back. In he comes. We'll watch the flags. All the uh, touch judges up it goes. And Stanningley, for the first time in the game, eight minutes half time, take the lead. It's uh, the first and Lions six, Stanningley eight. The way they've been playing, the wins that they've had have been absolutely fantastic. One away at Lee, one away at York, one yep. away at Toulouse. Some good players in there. I yeah. could know quite a lot of them. Here we come, kick from Copeland, over it goes. It's a four point advantage, it's Featherstone Lions six, standing with it ten. They're going to put on a, a, a training ground play. Gamble then moves in across two wides, off to this left side, trying to get it away again. Bit of a run on this flank from uh, Perkins, and Perkins tackled a couple of metres short of that line. They go over the line, it's Glassell, he tries to get the ball down, and I think he does. The referee Liam Rush says, and what a boost for Fed Lions playing up the hill. They've levelled the score. Just the left hand side, in he comes, strikes it. Nice and easy does it. And the Lions are back ahead here. It's Featherstone Lions 12, Stanningley 10. Big part of it, everything revolves around those, and he's got the kick. Yeah, Jackson with that success, and it's now a four point margin. Defensively, it's been the defences on top. In comes the big drive from Dean Gamble, slips it out. This time they might be the one that seals the game. Perkins, the man, going for the corner, and that's got to be it. Five Lions take that one in through Jake Perkins, and that really has got to seal the game with nine minutes left, but it's an eight point margin, a kick to come. Ruan, the other side players off. So a real last throw of the dice here for Jordan Lilly. And out they go with Gaskell on the right side. That's it. Featherstone Lions, Premier Division next year. Gaskell signs it. He's threatened throughout. He's gone over in the corner. And he'll be delighted with that. And that puts it beyond Stanley. Featherstone Lions 22, Stanley 10. The man of match slate, but the man of match will be selected by the members of the press, uh, which is traditional there below us, behind us. But uh, it would be Williams from here. Mimicom, Jackson, there you go. Drop goal for him. That's presumably for his bride, Sam Smith, who's here in the audience. Or oh, was called Sam Smith till yesterday. And that's the icing on the cake as far as, far as they're concerned. Take a lot from this season and they'll bounce back next year. Well, the countdown's on. The Hooter sounds. Featherstone Lions are the victors. They'll be playing National Gomes League Premier Division next season. Standing lay a gallant effort. But in the end, perhaps their own undoing was a few too many mistakes. Penalties have been fairly even, but four tries to one tells perhaps its own tale.